Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Violet. We are in the middle of a fly to a location to the academy. I'm not sure if it's going to trigger a cutscene as soon as we um, load up there. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of or get housekeeping and stuff taken care of Oops, here before we load back up. If you want to see how we got here and uh, us take on the Glaciato gym, the ice gym, watch the episode before this. Otherwise, I do want to remind you that we stream these videos live over at twitch.tv slash unexpectedly random. While you're over there, make sure you drop us a follow so we can send you a notification when we do live. Go. <laughs> so we can send you a notification when we go live which is typically Monday through Friday at 7 p.m. Central Time and Saturday and Sunday at 4 p.m. Central Time. When there are changes to that streaming schedule, um, updates are posted to our Facebook and Instagram pages, so make sure you follow us over there so we can stay up to date on any last minute or in advance changes. Otherwise, we have a TikTok and a Twitter if you're on those platforms and wish to follow us. And that takes care of all of the housekeeping, so we will get right into this. Okay, no cutscene. It is night, so we may be triggering a cutscene very closely, or very, very soon here. There is... Live. Yep. We're gonna take care of this interaction and then probably do some some classes before moving on to probably the last couple of gyms. Sup Levi. Well this is obviously live. Although I've been calling him Director Clevel this whole time. I'm gonna I'm gonna do him the favor because this may be one of the last times we interact like this, and I'm gonna acknowledge that he's Clive. Clive? <laughs> yep, that's my name. <laughs> Actually, no, it's time for me to bring this. <laughs> of course, of course. Actually, no, it's time for me to bring this little performance to an end. Allow me to reveal my true identity. Ha ha. He's bald? No, wait, what? <laughs> I do apologize for deceiving you with my disguise. Yeah, let's let's be honest. There was no deception. <laughs> none at all. <laughs> In the truth, the boy he knew as Clive was none other than the director of Uva Academy. Mr. Clavel! No, in the way! I already knew that. <laughs> what? Well, my disguise is perfect. Although, now that I think about it, I did neglect to keep up my youthful act on a few occasions. Also, you look the same. Plus, I've been known to do facial recognition work. So, can't trick me there. That must have been what gave me a flip. Regardless, I thought that said ruthless, and I don't know why. There is still one more astonishing truth I must reveal to you. Wait for it, wait for it. I think I mentioned something about this, but wait for it. The true identity of Cassiopeia, the big boss of Team Star, was me all along. For real? That's impossible. Um, I mean, recordings and voice modification software, I could see it working. Of course, we never actually heard Cassiopeia's voice, so... It, may have been a guy for real honest to goodness when you heard Cassiopeia over the phone it was actually a pre-recorded voice I pulled it off using you know one of those high-tech gizmos oh yes it was very clever one thing this guy has never been good about is lying about things his disguise, his Clive thing, all of it. 
And this is another one of those situations where it seems like he's trying to convince me of something. But I don't think it's... I don't think it's accurate. I'm not 100% sure. So, Master Levi, now you know I'm the big boss. That means there's just one thing left to do. Face me in one final showdown to decide it all. Okay, so hold on. That, uh, just, just, just backtrack here a bit for me. Um, kids were getting bullied. So Team Star stepped up and, and made a fuss about it. And then they branched off and left the school. The whole organization was then led by the director of the school who knew that they weren't attending the school and actively encouraged them not to, I believe. And now he wants to disband the organization and... I don't, I don't know if I'm entirely following here. It's a little bit weird. Face me in one final showdown to end it all. Well, I wasn't actually ready to battle right this moment. Orangu. Psychic type, fighting type. What's the level 60? I am Cassiopeia, Team Star. With this battle, I will I will finally bring Operation Starfall to an end. Look at me calling that that level there, level 60. Um, he's gonna destroy me. I don't remember if a Ranguru is psychic or he's gotta be psychic. I am faster than a level 60 or Ranguru. I wonder, can I interfere with... Can I interfere with the yawn effect? If I'm in the sky? No, it just voids my fly. This isn't going to end well, because even my highest is less than him. Wow, his Orangaroo is kind of short. <laughs> I was waiting for the, the view of the two of them again. Well, the assistant confirms that it is psychic and normal type, and uh, that makes it weak against dark type. That's not going to be enough. And we're sleeping on the next turn. I think if you force me to... Ooh, reflect war off. I think if you force me to go to sleep, I should get to recover some health from it. I want to 
you deal with that? Wake up. Dark, not very effective, because I'm dark type. Left over this. Good, good, good. We might possibly. He's got a full team of six, though. I don't know. And I'm guessing he's probably not type specific. Dunsparce level up. Obama Snow. Ice type. I don't have any fire type. Fire fighting rock and steel. Fighting ice and steel. We don't have anything. Honestly, my best bet at this point is going to be to terrestrialize to get the uh, um, the boost. And hopefully, it boosts my defense too. Why is it resistant to that? Blizzard's a one hit. No. And snow makes it more likely for Blizzard to hit. So I am I am toast. I am absolutely toast right now. Um We'll swap in Snom because he's going to be resistant to the cold. And then we're going to heal. Doesn't matter because Blizzard is a one hit. But it's only got five uses.
this because this will give me another round. And if this misses, it doesn't matter. It's really counting on you burning out those blizzards. That was a lot. Apparently, I snow or ice type is uh, a blizzard. It's three. Ice type is uh, super effective against grass type. So right now we're just kind of cycling, trying to. Get him to burn those blizzards out. Want it still gonna be fatal because it's so strong. Okay, the snow stopped, which helps. Should reduce the effect of this blizzard. Got to be careful not to send in Gardevoir, or I will cause it to blizzard again, and then that'll boost his. Mm, that's dangerous. Okay. Blizzard, so he misses. Because that'll give me an extra, a net positive healing. Blizzard, recoil. I'll take it. I mean, it's a little damage. Much. It doesn't show when it's back and forth like that. And surely one of these times Pikachu's going to uh, paralyze him. Loser. It's almost like their battle AI is a lot more intuitive than uh, previous games. This is just sequencing back and forth between these two. Attacks, and if that's the case, then I should be able to throw off the sequence if we send it in a Dunsparce. Because this should be Ice Shard. I'm gonna get this uh, Obama Snow to take himself out. <laughs> this is not the most graceful way to do this, but uh, if it's effective, I guess. 
hit it again. It's not supposed to hit. It's got like a 3% hit rate. It's so irritating. Use wood hammer on that. See how it goes for you. I do not have enough of these to keep doing this. No, that's fine. Keep the uh, keep damaging yourself. Because eventually you'll go down. Probably two more recoil. Please use wood hammer on my Pika. And not ice shard. Well, welcome to the uh, revive and switch simulator. So I'm sending in Dunn's first next because he's been doing it might still need a two more. on a wood hammer. <laughs> fatal for me, but fatal for you. I'm going to do something that's probably unwise. I'm going to go ahead and use this. And bank on him using wood hammer. Please. Nope. Snow's lot is typically wood hammer. I don't remember. And there's 
there's uh, floating hair walking by. That was weird. Thank you for your service, Snows a lot. Ghost type. Alrighty, so the assistant says Ghost types are weak to ghost and what was that book? Panic. Ghost types are weak to ghost and um Dark type. And Miascarata has a dark type move. Unfortunately, um, Poltegeist has weak armor, which also, according to the assistant, um, when it receives a physical attack, it's, its defense drops, but its speed increases. So, and Gardevoir has picked up weak armor, so we're probably in trouble. But we'll see if we can get a wish off. That's bad for a grass type. Oh, it's just a burn. It's not a damage. Okay. So that'll give us a wish. Burn didn't hurt much. Um, okay. Now I need to... Revive. Somebody. That's hard. That's fine, because my wish will come true on this next one. And it will give me half of Gardevoir's HP, which is 50. And that will... Um, let's not. Let's do Pikachu, because he's closer in level. Okay. And then we do... Oops. Oh, and actually... Hopefully, Poltegeist is faster. Nope, that's not what I wanted.
fail. Good, 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 good. At this point, I just need to get everybody alive. Um, this one. Because it's a matter of switching and healing the door. That's, that's fine. Just a burn. Not a big deal. Does my wish come true? the wish. Nope. I guess the wish is broken. Really? Okay. Buy you. Because that's going to be another option. Nice. Burns a little disappointing. It's kind of bogus that it can slightly lower its defense and greatly increase its attack. Super bogus. Um, we are going to... Wait. No, that's not Ghost of... It's just Ghost of Dark. It not really tough. Well, that hurts. Full health didn't matter. Okay. Yaskarada. Oh, plus it's attack boost. Yikes. That's okay, actually. You can work with that. Leftovers. Hmm. These don't suck a punch. Ooh, that's dark on dark. Not very effective. Okay, and the burn won't kill me. Fence fell up. That should be fatal. Okay. Okay. That's that's three down. <laughs> Got him in speed. Not super effective either. Toughed it out, but the fire's gonna take me out. Because I think it does more than the leftovers. No, it does exactly the leftovers. Okay, okay. Uh, okay. Um, let's hope he doesn't have Sucker Punch. Get a crit, please! Nope. No stone edge. Okay, that's alright. We can work with that. We can work with that. He's using rock types. 
So. Uh, I want it done sparse, but. Uh, let's go spray Tito because if he does go. Water type. I mean, it's gonna be fatal either way at that uh, difference, but. Meowscarata. Stone Edge now. Oh, nice work, Sprigatito! Good on ya. Okay. We need to. Oh, yeah. 89. So it's gonna have to be Hyper Potion on Meowzerata. Dodge it again, please. Oh. You did good. You did good. You really did. Okay. Bringing you back. That also, by fainting, that resets my stat changes. Amoongus is poison, and that's going to be wicked against my grass type. We'll keep. Uh, he's kind of sus, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know what to be done. I need to look at my crew. I've got enough to heal one and a half. But I'm full health here at 60 almost. Okay. Okay, so the assistant <laughs> says Amoongus is grass poison, which means I am in trouble. Um, and yeah, so at this point, grass is weak to poison, so grass attack is out. We're just gonna have to go here and try, try for the the full force. And we got speed on him. Avoided the attack. Toxic. Ew. Badly poisoned. Oh. That's less than the... Okay, that's fine. Play rough again. That did nothing. Gross. Hex, that hurts. No, it doesn't. That's a dark type. So the leftovers recovers more than the poison takes away, I believe. Maybe not. So fairy type is not very effective. That's more effective. This thing's a little, but manageable. Oh, yes! Yes! Good job, Meowscarada! Good job! Good job! Oh, good job! Good job! Good job! 
Oh, he's still got two more. Or he's still got, yeah. Crit. Oh no, don't be doing that. Yeah. On the bright side, leftovers and no poison, because Meowskarada is awesome. Yes. 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 Okay. 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 <laughs> Skeledurge. Well, the assistant is not being very helpful, so I'm going to have to manually find this. I don't know what a Cylidurge is. Oh, that's why I don't know what he is. Oh, no. That's very, very bad, very bad, very bad. He's a fire ghost and he evolves from Foy Coco. So he's weak to dark type still, but he's gonna hit hard. Okay. Well, let's let's try this. Stay here. Oh, and he, oh. oh I wonder what he's I hope he's got a ghost type terra terra type. Because he's gonna terra stall. Guaranteed. And this is this is my only option because grass is weak. Uh, fairy doesn't matter. Very well, it seems I shall have to terrestrialize my Pokemon. Who's the ghost? It's a fire terror type. Everything's over. All that to just get stomped here. Do take a step back, please. This may get dangerous. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I really don't know what I'm gonna do. I mean, I have no choice but to heal my... my lead here. That's weak. He's only level 25. There's no way he's gonna be able to manage it. Ice is going to be weak to fire, and Bug's probably weak to fire, too. I should have known. Yeah. Yeah, special move, not a physical move, so that's going to cause paralysis.
Oh, Good War is not grass type. I wonder what abilities Skeledurge has. Please. Wait, that might be that might be the cake. The, mm, hold on, hold on. Oh no, never mind. Blaze ups, fire moves in a pinch. That's not gonna help. I was hoping that was one that uh, like nullified fire type moves. Just gonna keep getting worse. Uh, I don't like that it's so close. And he's not a ghost, so that doesn't matter anymore. How does their low level attacks? Okay, it snows a lot. Send you in. Wish I had a pile of max revives. That would help. again. Please miss. Miss. That's gonna be super because it's fire and ice. And a critical hit. And his special attack. Need somebody with, with like a stat swap thing. Or I can just pop in. Miraidon, you should get out there. I've given you so many sandwiches, you should get out there and defeat him. <laughs> no way my speed <laughs> it's, it's faster than it hit and it did nothing paralysis paralysis is very good yes okay stay that way I have one revive left uh oh um this one stay please stay par paralyzed but the paralysis should slow him down. Gotta stay paralyzed. He 
please. Or flinch. Flinch would be good. Okay, that's good. That's good. The wish. Come on, wish. Wish. Leftovers first. There it is. Full health. I'm grass type, so fire type move's still gonna rip me apart. Oh, that was wish first and then leftovers. Okay. Okay. Um. He's no longer ghost type, so this is. This is better, actually. 60, 90. Yep. Critical hit? No! No! That's gonna be fatal. It's not. Tuffed it out. Special attack rows. Okay. Leftovers. So play rough was worse. Please. Nope. It's not very effective though. <laughs> we were so close. I have one Miraidon, get out there and Like, seriously. I was one move away from victory. Literally one move. If he had had, if he had been paralyzed one more time and, and got blocked so he couldn't move. Oh, that's so frustrating. That was a wicked battle. I fought hard. I used a lot of revimes. <laughs> I don't know if you were using my tarot orb. I think you did. This just to be sure. On the right side, they got some levels. Okay, yeah, my tower gets built. And of course, I'm back in the mountains because why not? Um. Yeah, I think that... Mm. I'm going to go ahead and call it there. Um, that was a rough battle. We'll come back next time and... We'll train a little bit, and then we'll head back for redemption. Now that we know what he has, we can... Uh, plan a little better. Uh. Wow, that was rough. Um, so, for those of you over on YouTube, I want to remind you that we do stream these videos live at twitch.tv slash unexpectedlyrandom. You can hop on over there and follow us on Twitch, and we'll send you a notification next time we go live, which is generally Monday through Friday at 7 p.m. Central Time, Saturday and Sunday at 4 p.m. Central Time. Tomorrow is... Well, I guess that won't apply, so I'll cover that. Yeah, I'll cover it here. Tomorrow, um, as of this recording, it does apply to you guys on YouTube, um, is Christmas Eve. So we're going to shoot for four o'clock. Um, it may be slightly shorter than normal on weekend. 
because uh, we've got a Christmas dinner with my family and grandparents and everybody so, um, later that evening. So I'll have to make sure I'm ready for that. But we'll still be here um, tomorrow at 4. Um, and we'll go from there. Um, otherwise, those of you on YouTube, make sure you're following us on Facebook and Instagram because if there's any change to the posted stream schedule, um, I always get it posted on those outlets. We also have a TikTok and a Twitter. If you're on those platforms and would like to follow us there, that would be great. There's not, um, They're not updated nearly as often as the other two. Otherwise, if you liked the video, um, it was an intense battle. <laughs> Uh, if you like the video make sure you leave a like that lets me know that uh, you're enjoying it and uh, forget to subscribe there on YouTube as well so other than that that's everything I have for today I appreciate you guys um, if you're seeing this on Christmas sometime Merry Christmas uh, this will be posted after Christmas this year but hey I got the Santa hat in the snow and I got the Christmas tree over there and some lights on the logo um, yeah, so Merry Christmas and stay random.